Hey Church, my name is Pearl and I'm part of the Central Campus as well as the Alpha team here at Audacious Church. It's a pleasure for me to share today's devotional on miracles and this will be based on two key scriptures. First of all, we've got Romans 12, 12 which says, Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction and faithful in prayer. Then we've got John 13, 7 which says, Jesus replied, you do not realize now what I'm doing, but later you will understand. So when I was thinking about miracles, I couldn't really pick a specific one. And that just because God, by his grace, has done so many great things in my life, as well as the lives of people in my surroundings. And well, that's another great reason to praise him, right? So then I thought about the common denominator between uh, all those miracles really and it made me think of the lyrics of a specific song which says what if the real miracle that I need is found in the waiting and that just made so much sense to me because I realized that sometimes I tend to neglect what actually happens in the waiting season but then when I look back at um let's say my most miracle uh, my most recent miracle sorry i realized that there's so many things that god has done in the waiting season and to give more context when i analyze the time between me praying for my health for instance and me receiving you know a blessing or a miracle of healing god has allowed me to you know get to know him better having a deeper stronger relationship with him and be more patient really the same applies to me praying for my work circumstances for instance while waiting for a miracle waiting for an answer to those prayers god has allowed me to you know be more disciplined learn more about different things that will that would impact my work and also be sort of i would say develop some self-control to some extent and all those things all those aspects so you've got discipline you've got getting to know god better you've got you, you've got so many things that you know god does while we wait for an answer and those things those aspects of our spiritual life are miracles themselves because when you think about it it there's a process of you know restoration of transformation you become you know you you grow more spiritually while waiting you you get to to know your father in a in a deeper way and all of these are considered as miracles too so i just want to encourage everyone really to you know open yourself to understand the meaning behind the waiting open yourself to to see things in god's perspective to to develop that patience and open yourself to really accept the fact that god's silence doesn't mean that he's not working he's always working be behind the scenes he's always busy doing something and sometimes it, it's literally things that he does to you to 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 contribute to your spiritual growth and all of these things all those things that contribute to your spiritual growth are miracles so i really hope that this devotion has blessed you and well take care of yourself and have a blessed day